Good evening, everyone. Look at that. We did it. The full case break of 2017-18 Panini Prism Basketball. Full 12-box break. One spot gets you three random teams each. So here are the people who are in this action right here. Let's triple your names up. That's one already. Here's two. And there's three. So you see Jordan Hope's last spot mojo star three times. All teams are in. Let's randomize each list. One and a five, six times. Names first, one, two, three, four, five, and six. We got Jeremy Merle on the pole. And now 021, Mark in the 30 spot. Matt Pinfield in the 10 spot. One and a five, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. We've got Bulls, Chicago Bulls down to the Bucks. Remember, this is 17-18, so this features uh, that awesome and deep rookie class from this year. Speaking of which, I'm watching the Lakers-Warriors game right now. Kyle Kuzma, Lonzo Ball, Josh Hart even. Some of the big rookies for the Lakers. Jeremy, so you have the Chicago Bulls. William with the Wizards. Mark, you have the Spurs. Andrew with the Thunder. Tim, you got the Suns. Kyle with the Blazers. Tim with the Nets and the Raptors. Jeremy with the Knicks. William with the Hornets. Uh, Thomas, you've got the Pacers. Jeremy with the Pelicans. Jordan with last spot. Mojo. Los Angeles Lakers gets my Lakers. Tim with the Mavs. William with the Timberwolves. Clippers for Thomas. William, Hawks and Rockets. Kyle with the Nuggets. Andrew with the Sixers. Jordan with the Lakers. So with your last, or uh, Warriors, with your last spot, Mojo, you have tonight's matchup. Lakers Warriors, Thomas with the Celtics, William with the Cavs, Tim with the Heat and Grizzlies, Andrew with the Magic, Mark with the Jazz, nice, Donovan Mitchells, Kings for Jordan, Kyle with the Pistons, and Mark with the Bucks. Nice. We've seen some Giannis Antetokounmpo autographs pop out of here too. Let's sort alphabetically by team. Feel free to trade if you'd like. Although, in a break like this, I'm not sure how many people will be bold enough to trade. I need here. So this break will take a minute or two. It's going to take a while. But once we're done, we'll still have plenty of time for other breaks tonight. So if you have something to do, uh, you've got it. You've got an hour to kill if you're not in this break. Or you can hang out. Feel free to watch, hang out, watch all the big hits that pop out of here. Um, Someone can always help me do eBay research just to give people a real-world idea of what these values are on a secondary market. We just chat some basketball, too. All right. Give everyone a couple more seconds to trade. All right, doesn't look like there's any trades, so we'll close up that trade window. TWC, trade window closed. So that list you saw on the previous screen remains the same. Going backwards here, there we go, right here on a Monday. So thanks everyone for joining us on a Monday. Um, we also have random team breaks available, like three box random team. Four box? Three or four box random team breaks available. Check on the website, jaspishobbyland.com. And we also have um, three or four box pick your teams available on jaspishobbyland.com. We just wanted to offer this for some of the high rollers who wanted to go big on a full case. But there's plenty of different ways to get into plenty of different ways to get into prison basketball, so check it out.
I've said this once, I've said this a million times, and I'll say it again. This draft class is deep, and this draft class has been producing, especially early on in the season. Here, I'll hold 12 right here. They have been producing, so the, um, the secondary market value has been pretty, pretty incredible for all these cards here. I was saying earlier, if you get like a, who has the Sixers? Andrew Wagner, so if you get Markel Fultz, if you get a Silver Prism card of his, which will be just like the, the regular, it's a refractor, that's all it is, of the base card, of his base rookie card, um, that might get pretty close, if I'm not mistaken, that might get pretty close, if not pay for your divisional spot. Someone look that up. I mean, I'm not even kidding. So there's a ton, a ton of value here. So get comfortable, get settled in. Let's talk basketball. Uh, what's uh, what's everyone's basketball team? What's your favorite basketball team? And um, how is your season going so far? Talk to me, folks. We've got an hour to break, hour to talk. So let's get some convo going. Obviously, my team's the Lakers. I'm an L.A. guy, so I've been supporting the Lakers since childhood, as have my parents. Um, dark, dark years for the Lakers. A lot of dark years for the Lakers. A lot of missteps and mistakes in ownership and the front office. But I think, slowly but surely, I think the I think the Lakers are kind of getting their act together. Slowly but surely, they're kind of getting their act together, and that's been pretty exciting for me. Because um, now there's at least some hope at the at the end of the at the end of the tunnel right here. The underground saying Knicks have made him really happy to be a fan this year by <laughs> my smashing mellow. Um, Cameron's a Raptors guy. How do you feel about your Raptors? I don't think they made a lot of big offseason moves, right? They feel confident with the team they had. And my sports box saying Bulls, they're messing up their draft pick. Are they are they playing too well? Lori Markin was a great pick was a great draft pick though. There's Justin Patton and Jason Kidd. So we'll top load all these later. Jason Kidd's out of 199. Set these aside right here. So this is considered the silver prison. Now I'm not sure how well Justin Patton does, but I'm sure you'd be surprised at how even a card like this would go for. So I'll, we'll sleeve all of those up and top load those a little bit later. No vet base ships. Emergent Donovan Mitchell and Terrence Ross, purple, at a 75 for the Magic. So the Magic, Orlando Magic, that'll go to Andrew. This Donovan Mitchell will go to the Utah Jazz. Like, this could probably go for 5 or 10 bucks, Mark. Like, that's the crazy thing. All, all of this will add up. If I found you a, like a parallel of that, that would go for a lot more. All right, Dirk Nowitzki, there's Lou Williams for the Clippers, Jamal Murray for the Nuggets. Like, if you get any of the rookies, th so like this parallel will ship because even though they're not numbered, that's why I'm kind of breezing by them. All the rookie cards will ship, obviously. This just won't ship, Iguodala. Obviously, Markel Fultz will ship. That card itself may go for, I don't know, 10 bucks or something like that. Denzel Valentine. That's your first auto of the break. That'll go to the Chi-Town Bulls, Chicago Bulls. That goes to Jeremy Merle with Chicago. Not numbered. Here, I'll set this right here. Nice, there you go. Markel Fultz, Silver Prism. Now, just so, just so I can tell you right here, let's look it up, 1718. Silver, silver, silver. All right, 150 bucks. So this card right here just paid. Who has the Sixers? Andrew Wagner has Sixers. This card just paid for half of his spot. We're only a box in. 
I, I don't think we're maybe no more than a few packs in. That's the value of this of this break, ladies and gentlemen. Even these Ben Simmons cards are selling, by the way. Like five, ten bucks a spot. There's our next autograph. That'll be rookie Jared Allen. For the Nets, that'll go to Tim Mahoney. That's Kobe Bryant. They just retired eight and twenty-four tonight for Kobe. There's Kobe Bryant and then Thomas Bryant. Dwight Howard's actually been playing pretty well. Andrew, there he is. You're welcome, Andrew. Congrats. Yeah, I don't know. Pe people were sleeping on this break, Andrew. The great thing is, it's not just... The great thing about basketball this year, folks, it's not just this one team or one player that's going to get you that. A lot of these, a lot of other, a lot of the other top rookies. There's at least four or five teams, you know, that could get you that kind of value back on those silvers. Timothy Mozgov, Nets edition, out of ninety-nine. Nice, that Jason Tatum, luck of the lottery. That'll go, that'll go for a decent amount as well. That goes to the Celtics, that goes to Thomas Johnson. See, I'll just start pulling these, these, these rookie parallels aside. Like just the regular standard ones will still kind of breeze by. They'll all ship though. But I'll set them aside so we can sleeve them up later. Serge Ibaka for the Raptors. The numbered cards I'll sleeve up right away. Nice Larry Bird. Justin Jackson, Kawhi Leonard, John Collins for the Hawks. Kyle Kuzma has been playing well. So that was box one. All right, next one. Underground continuing with with his Knicks commentary, saying it's good to know that Przingis is the man now. Yeah, he's the guy. He's the guy. It's his team now. Przingis has really been really been bringing it too. So good for him. Remember when remember when Knicks fans booed the Porzingis pick? Porzingis pick, but now look at him. Yeah, the Kuzma Prisms go for a decent amount as well. A decent penny. Not too shabby. The Underground says, well, Knicks fans are Knicks fans. They're mostly morons. So I think, I think that could go for any fan base. You know, because then you, cause you have... You have the hardcore fan base, you know that 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 know the know their know the squad in the G League. You know what I mean? They know G League players, and then there's just casual fans who just read the sports section, and that you know that's about it. Maybe know nothing about the subtlety of the sport. Trust me, it happens here in LA too. Believe it or not. All right. There's Kevin Durant, DJ Wilson, Hyper, Parallel, De'Aaron Fox, Emergent. Nice. Now 021 Mark, who's also in this break, saying he oh you just made it to your fantasy football finals. Congrats. A terrible season this year. Lonzo Ball. Let's 
question. No, that's not a. I thought that was a scratch. No, that's not. Lonzo Ball hyper. Stand by a sec. I just want to get. I want. I just want to wrap people's heads around what this stuff sells for. Prism basketball should be selling out left and right. So this card, this hyper card, can get you. I've seen some anywhere from 15 to 30 bucks. I'm seeing some sell for 40 bucks. Lonzo's actually been playing pretty decent. Well, I saw one go for 15 bucks. What's going on here? So the prices are kind of all over the place, but he has been playing a little bit uh, better recently. I've seen one go for $200, but that was in early December when this product came out. So it's not that high anymore. But I think some of the more recent ones, you can still get 50 to 75 bucks out of it. He's been playing a lot better too. So that helps. Jordan Hope, Lakers. That'll, that'll cover um, a nice chunk of your uh, spot there. So will that Kyle Kuzma. That might, he might even be selling better than Lonzo Ball right now. A little Laker Joe Mojo for Jordan. Tyler Lydon is your Nuggets autograph. That'll be for Kyle B. Mary Nance Jr. That guy can jump out of the gym. Andre Drummond. Remember his thing with Jeanette McCurdy? There you go. Larry Nance Jr. falling out. See that dunk. Ooh. Ooh. Out of 99 for the Raptors. Jacob Podel. Uh, with Toronto, that would be Tim Mahoney with Toronto. There's Andre Drummond again. There's Lonzo Ball. Josh Hart Emergent. We'll save those. Mike Budenholzer out of 199. Lonzo Ball Emergent. Paul George, they're doing the uh, retirement ceremony for Kobe Bryant. Uh, that Paul George goes to the Thunder, of course. That'll be for uh, Andrew. Nice, Lori Markin and Hyper Refractor for the Bulls. Jeremy Merle, that should be a nice one. Your autograph is Yogi Ferrell for the Dallas Mavericks. That goes out to Tim Mahoney. Nice one, Tim. Wow. Nice mojo, James Harden. That's out of 25. Let's sleeve some of these up for safekeeping. Not sure if you guys can hear the audio on the on the Lakers game, but they're retiring Kobe's number tonight at Staples Center. Both numbers, eight and 24.
Kobe looks like he could still play. Sign him up. Give him a. When, when, when can we, when can the uh, NBA teams give uh, give up or give out ten day contracts? I think not until like January, or February. But give him a ten day contract. He's um. He's apparently uh, coaching his uh, daughter's youth basketball team. <laughs> And he says, like, he has them, like, running the triangle offense and stuff. What do I think of Transcendent this year? I think it's great. I can't wait to break open our first case of it. I was surprised they did it a second year in a row, but I guess they did really well with it last year. Yeah, it's expensive, but I think... I think it's great, especially if you're like if you're personally collecting, if you're if you're PCing a product. That'd be great to have something high quality like that. Josh Jackson Emergent. There's Josh Hart, Quinn Snyder for the Jazz, out of one ninety nine. Uh, fundamentals, of course, Tim Duncan. Pretty epic music for this Kobe Bryant thing. Jonathan Isaac Emergent, Denzel Valentine, Aniogbu, Ruby, Wave. Those parallels, especially for the top rookies, really sell well. Dan Smith Jr., it's been a revelation. Al Horford, Purple, going to the Celtics, Thomas Johnson, out of 75. Dan Smith Jr., that goes to Tim Mahoney, by the way. Donovan Mitchell, looking for a silver on that one. There's Larry Nance Jr. Donovan Mitchell, silver would be great. Jonathan Isaac. For the magic. Orlando Magic going out to Andrew Wagner. Nice one, Andrew. Jason Kidd for the Bucks. That's for Mark. 24 out of 49 on Jason Kidd. A lot of people in LA hoping that Lonzo Ball will be a Jason Kidd type player. I think that's his that's the that's the ceiling anyway. I don't know if Lonzo Ball was will be as good of a scorer. I don't think he plays as good at defense either, but I guess no one really plays that good of defense <laughs> these days. Nice Ruby Kuzma for the Lakers. That'll go to Jordan. That should, that should go for pretty well. And Aniogbu for the Pacers. Nice autograph for Indiana, Thomas Johnson. Nice Markel Fultz emergent. That's for the Sixers. That's for Andrew. Just keep just keep racking up those uh, racking up those uh, parallels, Andrew. You'll have the spot paid for within a couple boxes. There's Fultz again. There's Fizdale, no longer with the Grizz, unfortunately. I don't know if Fizdale got a fair shake in Memphis. DJ Wilson for the Bucks, out of 199. Terrence Ferguson for the Thunder. A parallel going to Andrew and OKC out of 199.
It's a nice ceremony for Kobe Bryant happening here in L.A. Process, what's going on? Yeah, the Sixers are going to be a scary team in a few years. Yeah, Embiid has been playing incredibly. And I, f I feel like... Uh, I feel like they've been they've been using they've been managing Joel Embiid's minutes really well too, really carefully. You know, they're, I don't think they have not played back to backs. Um, they give him regular days off. They keep him healthy, and that's a good thing. Ben Simmons seems to be the real deal. You know, and so they get some more experience under their belts. Another couple draft picks, maybe big free agent or two next thing you know next thing you know Sixers could be Sixers could be really good especially in that east especially as LeBron moves west Magic Johnson introducing uh, Kobe Bryant in the jersey retirement ceremony. For the Kings, there's Justin Jackson. Nice Justin Jackson for Sacramento. That would be uh, Jordan Hope with one of his three last spot mojos. Yeah, process is like I've waited a long time through a lot of dreadful seasons for the Sixers and probably the Eagles too to, to get back on track. Hey, same with same with the Lakers too. Same with the Lakers as well. A lot of, lot of dark years for the Lakers, and I think finally we're seeing a little bit of light now. Justin Anderson, 19 out of 25. Wow, nice. There you go for the Sixers. Justin Anderson, Mojo Refractor, Sixers, Andrew Wagner. Nice one, Andrew. Good break for you. Ooh, Derek White, Emergent Gold. Six out of ten. That's nice. Nice one for the Spurs. That'll be for Mark. Aaron Fox emergent silver parallel. Donovan Mitchell emergent. Blake Griffin out of 199. Sterling Brown for the Bucks at a 75. Yeah, Alonzo does need to step up a little bit. But I've always said this. I never really thought of Lonzo as like, oh, he's going to be a primary, a primary scoring option as soon as he got into the league. I definitely just needed him to pass the ball, basically. There's Josh Hart, Hyper. Um, so... I know a lot of people in LA are like, why isn't Kobe shooting, or what well, Kobe, I'm watching the Kobe retirement. Why isn't Lonzo shooting, you know, scoring 15, 20 points a night? There's Harrison Barnes, 99. Well, there's a lot of reasons, his shot. Needs a little work, that's for sure. But I think mostly, wow, another Markel Fultz, emergent hyper. Uh, but I think mostly, I don't think they're asking him to really do that. They want Lonzo to distribute the ball more. He does have great court vision. He does pass the ball really well. He's been shooting. He's been shooting better lately as well. There's Alfred Payton for the Magic, out of 199. 
And I think in, in, the, in the current role that Lonzo is in, I think he's going to do fine. Especially with guys like Kuzma playing lights out, scoring well, Brandon Ingram playing really well. So, you know, Lonzo doesn't actually have to be that kind of player. Eventually, maybe. I don't know. Hey, if he ends up being an average starter, I mean, at the end of the day, I, w I wouldn't mind that, actually. <laughs> you know, if that guy could turn out to be an every game starter, well, there's so many, when there are so many players that could be busts, and then, you know, or and out of the league in a few years or whatever, but... But you know, I uh, you know, I'll, I'll take Lonzo Ball being a, a consistent starter. Jersey's up in the rafters now for Kobe. It's pretty amazing. There's Derek White. Derek White autograph for the Spurs. That'll go to Mark. The glove. Jason Tatum hyper. Nice, Porzingis as well, Red uh, Ruby Wave. Nice Donovan Mitchell for the Utah Jazz from Mark. Celtics is Thomas. Nice. Lonzo Emergent. Dave Yoger out of 99. Lori Markin and Luck of the Lottery. Darren Fox Emergent. Stan Van Gundy Refractor. Dion Waiters to 199 for the Heat. Be for Tim. Rick Carlisle, Onuaku. Etwan Moore is your autograph. Nice one for the Pelicans. Jeremy Merle with the Pelicans. Seth Curry, 22 out of 49 for the Mavs. That'll head out to Tim. Mike Conley for the Grizzlies. 199. A little bit of glue on the back right there. Grizzlies, that'll go to Tim. Jonathan Isaac.
Jeff Teague. Uh, 75 for the T-Wolves. It's for William. Uh, I think that was just a base, Mark. Oh no, that luck of the lottery was silver actually. Look at that. See the refractoriness to it. What will what will this go for? Someone look that up. Just in the interest of time, I can't stop every time, but I know that, that Donovan Mitchell has been balling out and a card like that could do pretty well on a secondary market. Probably a lot more a lot better than you may assume. All right, we're eliminating some boxes here. We're making a little extra space here. That's good. We have six boxes to go, plus this box right here. So we're almost halfway there. Ceremony for Kobe Bryant. His jersey's 8 and 24 being retired. Big fan of Kobe Bryant. All right. Josh Hart. Dave Yorger again at a 199. Porzingis. So I'm going to try to breeze through this break a little bit more quickly. Nice. Mark saying that that last Donovan Mitchell, silver, luck of the lottery, 150 bucks. There's Lonzo Ball Hyper. De'Aaron Fox, nice. Ruby Wave, that'll probably go for a decent amount. So it's great because now Mark has almost... Uh, Almost half his spot paid for already. There's Caleb Swanigan for the Trailblazers. That'll go to Kyle. Mike Muscala for the Hawks. William Hutton with that autograph. There's Thibodeau. Tilakina has also been a bright spot for the uh, Knicks. Yogi Ferrell for the Mavs. I'll be at a 199. The Tilakina goes to uh, Jeremy Merle. Yogi Ferrell going to Tim Mahoney and the Mavs. There's Kobe. Jamal Crawford for the Timberwolves. That's out of 75. That'll be for William. Zach Collins for the Trailblazers. Nice rookie autograph for Portland. Kyle, that auto. Got Anthony Davis fundamentals. Is that numbered? No, it's a nice parallel though.
Nice Lori Markinen. Hyper. Let me sleeve these guys up and move on to the next box. I'm telling you folks, look up if you're if you've been hesitant about these prism breaks here. Look up some of these some of these basic. I mean, the, that Lonzo Ball hyper parallel is not even is not even numbered, and you'd be surprised at how much they'll go for on a secondary market for some of the top rookies. So we just have those boxes left. We're almost there, ladies and gentlemen, almost there. We're making pretty good time. Good luck, everyone. That's why this, this full case break, that's why it has such great value in it. And since you're getting kind of three teams all at once, just gives you gives you a better opportunity to get bigger hits. So we should have this break done in the next, oh, I don't know, half hour or so. I'm gonna try to move a little bit more quickly now that we've kind of gotten a good idea of what the, the big hits are and the pattern of this break. Good luck, everybody. Tobias Harris for the Pistons out of 199. Marcus Smart. Marcus Smart for the Celtics, Thomas Johnson. Terrence Ferguson emergent. And for the Utah Jazz, Tony Bradley. Rookie auto for Mark and the Jazz. Thomas Bryant. Ivan Rabb. For the Grizz out of 49. Uh, that'll go to Tim. Doc Rivers, Marcin Gortat. Jason Tatum, emergent. Bismarck out of 199. Biombo. That'll go to the Orlando Magic. That'll be for Andrew. Jonathan Isaac. Dollar for the Warriors out of 75. Golden State Warriors, Jordan with the Warriors. Markel Fultz emergent. And Etwan Moore. Out of 99. 
All right, next box. Lakers are keeping it close with the Warriors. 57 to 53, Warriors lead by four for the second half just about to start. Just started right now. I think Lakers kept the game close with the Warriors a week ago. J.J. Redick for the Sixers leads us off. And Derek White is your autograph. That'll go to the Spurs. That'll be for Mark with the Spurs. Steph Curry. And nice Kyle Kuzma mojo for the Lakers. Jordan. I'm not sure what this will go for, but probably a decent amount. 19 out of 25. That is strong. Donovan Mitchell emergent, just a base. Courtney Lee for the Knicks. That's out of 75. Justin Jackson for the Kings. There's De'Aaron Fox out of 199. So a couple of nice Kings for Jordan. Nice. DJ Wilson, Bucks, Mark, with this autograph. Nice Dan Smith Jr., Silver, Dallas Mavericks, Tim Mahoney. Nene for the Rockets, out of 199. Tilakina. Oh, it's like Kuzma scoring a couple early points to give the Lakers a 60 to 59 lead over the Warriors. Kuzma playing well. Kelly Aubrey Jr. at a 99 for the Wizards. Man, I think everyone knew that everyone knew that Kuzma was a good like shooter. You know what I mean? Wow, that last Kuzma sold for $501, says Mark. <laughs> well, there you go. That was unexpected. Just like how uh, Kuzma's play has been unexpected. Everyone knew, as I was, as I was gonna say, everyone knew that he was a good shooter. You know, I mean, he's still a late first round pig, decent shooter, you know, good basketball IQ and all that sort of stuff. Um, and, you know, you would expect, you can expect, hey, you would not be surprised if Kuzma played a couple, had a couple big games here and there. But I think what, of course, is exciting 
or surprising is the consistency. Like he's doing it every night. Like he's playing well every night. For the most part, which is not common for for a rookie like that getting those kind of minutes. You know, increasingly got more minutes is pretty much a starter at this point now. And it, there's there's really no indication that he's going to that he's going to like you know slump significant. I mean, aside from the usual rookies getting used to a long season, blah 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 blah. But there doesn't seem to be anything like fundamentally wrong with his shot or the way he plays the game, whatever the case may be. It's just a lot of experience and learning, and I think he's got the raw skills. As long as he keeps adjusting to NBA defenses and plays defense, I mean, Kuzma's been great. A revelation here in Los Angeles. I can't believe it. Deonta Davis is your first autograph out of this box. Fourth to last box. That'll go to the Grizz, Memphis. That will be Tim. Dan Smith Jr., emergent, hyper. That'll go to Tim Mahoney. Devin Booker for the Suns out of 199. Phoenix, that'll be for Tim, Tim Mahoney. Wes Unseld. Manoj Nobly, Goran Dragic. Eric Spolstra out of 99. Jordan Bell for the Warriors. How's Jordan Bell doing? I think he's got 14 minutes under his belt right now. Four points, and an assist, and a couple blocks. Tony Bradley for the Jazz. 35 out of 49 for Mark and the Utah Jazz. Nice. Zach Collins Silver for the Trailblazers goes to Kyle. Luke Kennard, Emergent, and Kyle Kuzma, Hyper. So Jordan Hope just racking up the, the big hits out of this prism. That Kuzma mojo pretty much paying for, uh, paying for his spot. And then some. <laughs> That's how awesome this stuff is. Clay Thompson for the Warriors. Out of 75, Warriors come out to play. There's Frank Jackson for the Pelicans out of 199. We'll sleeve up and top load all of those at the end of the break. On Yogbu, Hyper. Seeing that Brandon Ingram on the ground. The 
stepped on someone's foot. He went for a block and just went down. All right, three boxes to go. We're almost there, folks. Almost there. I only see a few orders coming in, so if you're waiting for uh, the next break, now's the time to get your orders in on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We've got plenty of prison basketball on the website, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Go and check it out. Pick your teams or random teams. Still plenty of time for uh, for some awesomeness to be pulled out of here. We've got some points. Um, if there's more than one, uh, if there's another points card, I'm going to be consolidating them into one. And um, so it's a winner take all for the points, by the way. So that takes place of an autograph. We'll randomize that at the end, along with the holiday scratchers. Joan Evans for the Clippers. Cheek Diallo for the Pelicans at a one ninety nine. Wow, Luke Walton, one of one, Luke Walton for Jordan Hope and my Lakers. A little Laker Joe Mojo, as I drop these top loaders here, a little Laker Joe Mojo coming through for you, Jordan Ho. The coach, Luke Walton, former Laker as well, of course. Bill Walton's kid. Jordan, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Kyle Kuzma emergent. Thomas Bryant, rookie, out of 199 for the Lakers. I'm pretty sure the Lakers are still available in our pick your team breaks. I think they're only like three or four box pick your team breaks, so the, uh, the value is really good. Divide up the price a little bit better so it's a little friendlier on the wallet. So check it out, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Frank Jackson for the Pelicans. Pelicans, that'll go to Nolens, Jeremy Merle. You already saw what that uh, what that mojo went for for that Kuzma. Mark saying that it last one sold for five hundred and one dollars. That's not bad at all. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Not sure what this parallel could go for, but I'm sure a decent amount. He's been playing very well, as will this LeBron James for the Cavs. That'll go to William Hutton. And a 99 for the Timberwolves. Hmm, Dwayne Bacon, Refractor, Silver Prism. Kent Bazemore to 75 for the Atlanta Hawks. Delicious, delicious bacon going to William. And the Hawks purple chrome going to uh, William Hutton as well. And you know what I'll do? I'm going to set this aside right here so I don't forget to do the holiday scratcher. All right, just two boxes left, boys and girls. Good luck.
Remember, we have more Prism basketball on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We've got more 1718 basketball, not just Prism. We have Court Kings available and Totally Certified available. Um, those breaks, they're, they're, well, they're priced accordingly, but but uh, they may not have like the huge, uh, huge hits that Prism has, but Prism is a lot more expensive than those two products. And it's kind of like a you get what you pay for kind of thing, but there's still a lot of big hits relative to the price in Court Kings and in Totally Certified. So if you got a, a similar hit out of Totally Certified for that Kuzma, I mean, you can still make hundreds of dollars off of it, I'm sure. So take a look into that. Do your research, of course, on eBay and whatnot. And let's have a lot of fun with this Prism Basketball stuff because this year is going to be a great year for hoops. Do not miss out. All right, Jonathan Isaac at a 99 for the Orlando Magic. Uh, that'll be for Andrew. Kyle Kuzma, Silver Prism. It's another big one for Jordan. Sadoransky for the Wizards at a 199 for William. I'll bet that'll resell very well. Wow. Kobe Bean Bryant on card autograph out of Prism Basketball for Jordan Hope. Tonight of all nights to pull a Kobe Bryant autograph on the night. His jersey, 8 and 24. Retired at Staples Center by the team. Wow. That is amazing. In the second to last box, there he is again. It's a special kind of night for Kobe Bryant. I'm going to let Kobe know. We'll, we'll, we'll tweet at him. We'll just be like, hey, Kobe, congrats. Greg Popovich at a 75. Mr. Diecast, what's going on? And Frank Kaminsky, what a box. Frank Kaminsky, autograph for the Charlotte Hornets. That'll be for William Hutton. Valachunas at a 199 for the Raptors. That'll be for Tim Mahoney. And the last box, folks. Oh, the Kobe only sells for on that. That sounds about right. There's a, there's a lot of autographs out there over the years for Kobe Bryant. The rookies the rookies out of this year will clearly go for a lot more just because supply and demand is like their first original cards. But hey, still a nice hit nonetheless. William Demet asking what is going on after this. I don't know. I only see three orders coming in. So unless those three orders sold out a break, which I don't think they did. Bill Anton, Ashley, and Eric 
got spots. But I don't know what they got. I, I'll have to check after this break. Has anything filled? Does anyone know? Is there anything missing from the front page of the website? JaspiesHobbyThat.com. When it gets to zero, and that's that's how you know something sold out. Barros, you want in? What's up, Dave? We'll get something. JaspiesHobbyLand.com. Tell us what direction we should go. Be sure to look, folks. Go to JaspiesHobbyLand.com. Be sure to take a pay close attention to the breaks involved in the All Spots Sold promo so that your orders will be involved in the promo tonight. I don't want people missing out. Unless you don't care about getting stellar or transcendent spots for a fraction of the price. If not, then just buy whatever you want to buy. And we'll break whatever fills up up until, I don't know, 11 o'clock Pacific around there. Got Marvin Williams for the Hornets at a 99. The Glove, Gary Payton. Jalen Brown, Serge Ibaka. Wow, Markel Fultz. Autograph, 76ers, Andrew Wagner. Nice, big Markel Fultz autograph for the 76ers. There's Dion Waiters, and there's Mike Muscala for the Hawks out of 49. Trevor Graham. For the Hornets, that'll be for William Hutton, Trayvon, Travion Graham. My apologies to Travion. And Jonathan Isaac, Emergent, Hyper, Refractor. Donovan Mint. Donovan Mitchell, nice. Emergent. I, was, I almost combined Mitchell and Emergent together. Too many M's. That'll go to Mark and the Jazz. All right, we are almost there, folks. This has been a pretty great case thus far. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. Hopefully everyone else is too. I'm pretty sure everyone got something kind of decent. Mark is smart for the Celtics out of 199. For Boston, that'll go to Thomas Johnson. The Ageless Wonder of Insanity, Vince Carter. Evan Turner for the Trailblazers out of 199. And the last bit, boys and girls, we've got a Justin Patton Emergent, Carl Anthony Towns, Russell Westbrook, 75 for the Thunder. That's for Andrew. And we're going to close out with Gallinari, Courtney Lee, and Kemba Walker. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. What a great break. A lot of big hits out of here. Thanks so much, everyone, for getting in. Come on. That, that's pretty awesome. All right, so let's give away 600 points. Well, not give away. Randomize it to one person in the break, and then we'll see. We'll give away those. Two. Two people will be able to get scratcher spots out of 10. All right, so I have... Actually, let's just do it this way. So 
So just to distinguish, these are going to be for the, I'm going to write PTS for points. So the name on top will get 600 points. And then using the same dice roll, the name on top on this list, um, two names on top on this list will get holiday scratchers. Let's roll the dice. Six and a two, eight times for each list. Points first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Name on top is William Hutton. After eight, and that's actually a decent amount of points, William. So 600 points coming your way. Thanks for getting in. And those are for the points. And now for the holiday scratchers. Remember, as we said in the item description, two holiday scratchers right here. So six into two, eight times, top two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Top two are Jeremy Merle and Jordan Hope. So Jeremy Merle, you're first. Let's see what we got here. Good luck. You're also in the, uh, all the winners of these holiday scratches also get into a big, uh, large pool. So I think there's like 70 some odd scratchers. And of that, you'll be, in, you'll be in another drawing for even bigger prizes than what you get here. And this is pretty nice too. 2017 Tops On Demand set featuring the 600 Home Run Club. I think we, we sell these for like, what, $100 or something like that? We sell them for a lot. So that's a, that's a pretty good deal right there. And sometimes there can be autographs in those sets too. So good luck on that. All right. Next up, Jordan Hope. Jordan, you got the second one right here, so you're up second. Let's see what we got. Let's... All right, good luck to you. Let's see what you get. Oh, that's cool. All right. You get a box of cards. That's uh, looks like that's 1617. There you go, 1617 Panini Prestige Basketball. Ben Simmons rookie cards in here. You get one of those. I mean, there's no autographs, but he's exclusive to Upper Deck. But if you get uh, some of his base cards, like rookie cards, parallels, I don't. That could help pay for another spot in these or this uh, three-team break. And there you have it, folks. That was a full case monster break on a Monday. Thank you very much for hanging out with us. Appreciate you watching the break. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.